in the last lecture we have learned with divide and conquer and without divide and conquer matrix multiplication so till after that uh, we have seen that uh, what is the recurrence relation according to that we will write let tn be the amount of time required to multiply two matrices of size n into n then what will be the recurrence relation tn will be equal to order of 1 if n is less than equal to 2 but if it is if n greater than equal to 2 into 2 then what then 8 t n by 2 plus 4 n upon 2 whole square so these are the 8 are the sub problems as we have seen in the last lecture we divide the entire matrix into the 8 and 4 is constant here why let's see from the last lecture we have divided the entire matrix into the 8 sub problem because there are 2 so individually we have divided 4 into 4 to total 8 and every time we are doing when we are multiplying it so we are doing 4 addition so like that we have done so according to that I am writing the recurrence relation so how we are going to solve it so we can simply say because this is constant so we can simply write like this tn is equal to 8 t n by 2 plus n square plus n square we can write like this uh, because uh, we are neglecting the cost of uh, the addition in respect of the multiplication so that's why we are writing n square so if we are going to solve it so we'll write 8 8 t n upon 2 square plus n by 2 whole square plus n square so we are uh, solving it so 8 square t n upon 2 square and uh, plus 2 n square plus n square because um, here is 8 and here is 4 so it will be 2 and so uh, for further 8 cube t n upon 2 cube plus 2 is plus uh, we are writing like this 2 square n square plus 2 to the power 1 n square plus 2 to the power 0 n square so if we do it up to k time then it will be 8 to the power k t n upon 2 to the power k plus 2 to the power 0 n square plus 2 to the power 1 n square like that it will go 2 to the power k minus 1 n square because here 2 square and here cube that's why k minus 1 n square so 8 k t1 y it will be t1 because we are supposing here um, we are supposing n upon 2 to the power k is equal to 1 so n is equal to 2 to the power k n is equal to 2 to the power k or we can say simply log n base 2 is equal to k from here so n upon 2 k uh, we are supposed n upon 2 to the power k we are supposing 1 so we are writing here 1 plus uh, we are taking uh, um, n square common 2 to the power 1 0 1 like that plus 2 to the power log n base 2 minus 1 so k will be a to the power log n base 2 and uh, plus n square and if we are going to solve it so 2 to the power log n base 2 minus 1 upon 2 minus 1 it will be like that so here because this is 8 so 2 to the power 3 so it will be n cube by so, uh, replacing it and uh, plus n square we are going to solve it so it will be like that so here will be n cube plus 
n cube minus n square so it will be order of n cube order of n cube so we can simply say uh, or we can say without divide and conquer matrix multiplication is better is better because it consume less space or we can say no stack is required <laughs> So here, if we talk about instead of this, if we use stress in matrix multiplication instead of this, because it gives better result in terms of multiplication. That's why we are going to use this. So instead of eight sub problems, it converted into the seven sub problem and four addition converted into the eighteen. addition so how we are going to see what is the stress in multiplication order of 1 if n is less than or equal to 2 into 2 and if it is n greater than or equal to 2 into 2 then 7t n by 2 plus 18 into n upon 2 whole square this is a stress in multiplication recurrence relation so we can simply say tn is equal to 70n by 2 plus 4.5 n square if we open it it will be 4 4 divided by 18 divided by 4 so it will be 4.5 or we can simply say 70n by 2 plus n square or we can say simply order of n log 7 base 2 or we can simply say order of n to the power 2.81 so this is the stress in uh, solution for two matrix multiplication and we have seen in the last lecture without divide and conquer with divide and conquer so what is the best one the best one is stress in matrix multiplication